Hey there, Internet friends. Trevor Starkey here with another episode of Movie Monday. In honor of GLOW launching on Netflix this last weekend, I wanted to touch on Heel Kick, the wrestling mockumentary I saw when I was in San Francisco for Kind of Funny Live 3. Heel Kick is an independent film from Canada, uh, written, directed, and starring a gentleman by the name of Danny Mack. Danny is playing a guy named Reggie, uh, someone in his late 20s, 30s, who has dreams of grandeur and being a professional wrestler, but but he's a bit more of a burnout than anybody with motivation. He and his buddy Maurice, who's played by Chris Wilcox, uh, are kind of challenged by Reggie's brother to really commit to this dream of becoming a wrestler. His brother pays for wrestling classes for the two of them, um, but the caveat is if he misses any of those classes or if he doesn't pass his midterms or his finals, uh, he will be forced to move out of his parents' house. This is all shown off through the lens of a documentary crew directed by Roger, uh, actor Cooper Babaud in this film, and collaborator of Danny Mac. And the story plays out with Reggie and Maurice not really realizing how much intensity and how much athleticism is actually required for it, so you see them kind of take the blows and take the hits as they go to wrestling training, and it's not all about you know, promotions and flips and stuff. And it becomes pretty clear pretty quickly that they have much bigger, more grandiose ideas in their head of how good they are than we as the audience actually see them. But you start to root for them as the underdogs, and as you, especially as you see Maurice kind of start to pick up some qualities and, and kind of come in his own. Uh, you see Reggie jealous of that growth and trying to kind of come to terms with it himself. I went in expecting kind of a mockumentary, kind of humor wrestling kind of show. I was not disappointed at all. It was a really good movie, really well done. Um, one of the things I love about the mockumentary style is the efficiency of storytelling that you get with it, because effectively, and like what The Office did so well, and Parks and Rec, and even Modern Family, and shows of that ilk, what they get away with is you have somebody talking to the camera while you have video playing over that often contradicts what that person is saying. So you're telling two stories at the same time, um, and you're getting to kind of tell the joke and the punchline in the same beat, in the same kind of comedic moment. Or you get to tell like a really dramatic moment as a character is kind of saying something very profound, you get to see them acting in a profound way at the same time as well. And Heel Kick does a pretty good job utilizing that element of storytelling. They also really kind of play with the idea of the documentary crew themselves as characters in the story. Most notably with Roger, the director of the documentary, he becomes really wrapped up in the story of Reggie and Maurice. He kind of laughs them off as a joke at the beginning of the film, but really becomes connected to them, and he really starts pulling for their success throughout. There's a lot of great humor in the movie. As somebody who grew up with wrestling and is getting back into it right now, I really enjoyed a lot of the wrestling moments in the film. Um, most notably, kind of the the very beginning training moments where the characters don't know how to take the bumps and the falls and stuff, and so you watch them kind of take a fall to the mat and know just how badly they did it and how intentionally badly the actors did it, so how much it must have hurt to kind of take those hits and take those bumps. And in the audience that I saw it with, the Kind of Funny community, um, there were a lot of like groans and oh, ooh, and kind of cringe moments when we saw those kind of beats. Definitely a ton of fun. Uh, I think they're going to do a few more kind of premieres throughout the country as they can um, in the coming months. And then I believe their ultimate plan is kind of like iTunes distribution, going to get it up on, on iTunes and Netflix. If you're going to be in Austin for RTX, specifically the Thursday before, on July 6th, they're doing a screening of Heel Kick there that I believe Greg and Danny will be a part of, uh, and they'll do like a, an audience Q&A afterwards. That's what they did at the, at the Kind of Funny Live midnight screening. Uh, I definitely recommend checking it out if you're going to be there. I'll put a link in the description below for ticket information. If you've seen Heel Kick, let me know what you think about the film in the comments below. As always, I've been your host, Trevor Starkey, from trevortrove.com. You can follow me at Snarky Starkey on Twitter. And until next time, from here at the Trove, treasure your friends.